Hi there, today I'm gonna show you the best kept secret in Excel. Come, I will show you. Excellent, I'm gonna show you the function date div. You will notice that that function is not listed here. I'm telling you, this is a top secret. I open parentheses and I can see the function here, but it doesn't have any parameters. The first parameter will be the date from, comma, the second parameter, the date to, comma, one more parameter, what do I want to get back? The year, the month, or the day. If I want the year, I open quotation marks, I put by the Y, close quotation marks, and close parentheses, and I press enter. There is only one year between December 14, 2021, and October 8, 2023. Uh, keep in mind, I live in Canada, so for that reason, you see the date format in this way. Next, let's say I want to know how many months I have between January 11, 2022, and January 7, 2024. So I'm gonna say, I'm gonna copy the formula that I have in the cell above. So I'm gonna press Control T to copy exactly or to duplicate the same information that I have in the cell above. And instead of Y, what I'm gonna provide is an M. I can provide the M in capitals or lowercase. I'm gonna press Enter. There are full 23 months between these two dates. The next will be the days. So I'm gonna press Control D again to duplicate the information that I have in the cell above. And, and now I'm gonna provide the D. I press enter. And here we have 642 days between February 8, 2022 and November 12, 2023. I can prove this by saying equal last date minus the first date. Enter 642. Excellent. I can see that this information is correct. So now you know how to get the difference in year, just like this, months just providing the M, or in days, just providing the D. Hope you found this information useful. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.